KPD still on the air? Maybe in Mexico. L-O-L. I honestly don't keep up with radio these days. Hey, if they're not going to return my calls, I'm not going to listen to them. But back when I was running KUPD, it was the number one station of all time. Did you know that? Right. Like the biggest radio station that existed to that point. And then I left, and it was like they just closed it down. A ghost town. Crickets. Someone said to me the other day, because they brought it up, and I never do, Dave, they've only had two GMs, two program directors, one sales manager, and two morning hosts in the past 20 years. You were fired. One of the GMs died. And so that means there's really only been one other major change since before 9-11. And I said, they're still relevant because of what I created for them on a napkin in my apartment. And they said, I thought you said they weren't relevant. Wasn't that the whole point? And I said, look, Circle K bathroom mirror, I set the table for them, and that's why it still works. And they said, okay, but again, you said they're not successful. Also, it's been 20 years. A big chunk of their audience either moved here since then or isn't old enough to remember you at all. And also, I'm a mirror. This is insane. And I said, insanity rhymes with Hannity. God, he's a good friend of mine. So many belly laughs. My sides hurt every time I see him. And they said, seriously, what the fuck is going on right now? I'm a mirror in a convenience store bathroom. How am I the sane one? And then we said our goodbyes, and I drove around my neighborhood for three hours because I have no purpose, baby!